What's your name, sister? Uh, my name is Mel, and my company is, is um, Art Creations by Mel. Okay. Hold on for a second. Keto. 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 Yeah, she has one. Sorry. Sorry. Because you could pop over another bottle because it is just here. And this is one whole wine that we're drinking. Cheers. Do you like it? Yeah. This is a dry wine. We have sweet wines over there. Um, dessert wines. Okay. We have different type of wines, so you definitely be able to taste some today. Yes, ma'am. So back to her. Um, definitely. Um, so tell us your information again, baby. Um, my name is Mel. Like I said, Okay. Oh, um, company name is Art Creations by Mel. Um, I can be found on all social media. Um, on Facebook, Art Creations by Mel. And Instagram underscore art creations by Mel, but I'm gonna I'm work on that content. I'm gonna get it, but yeah. So those are my two social medias. Oh, and also TikTok, um, art creations by Mel. Very dope talent. Very dope. So tell us about your artwork and what do you do? The type of artwork you do? How you do your artwork? Where your artwork is going to be displayed? Okay. Okay. Um, when you take the time to do your right. artwork. It's time consuming. Yeah, it, it is. And it's very detailed, as you can see. Um, very detailed. Um, so definitely, um, yeah. I got go you. ahead, boo. Go so ahead. I'm listening. I'll kind of break it down a little bit. So a lot of my work um, takes, a little, well, pretty much everything takes a lot of time. Um, the average piece can take up to 20 hours to 25 to 20. I think the highest, the longest piece I did was about 30 hours. Oh, wow. um, I have had my art display at um, Artworks RVA Gallery on Hall Street and also um, the event last year, um, Rhythm on, on the River and VMFA. That was in August of 2021. So my artwork was displayed out there as well. Um, pretty much Art Creation by Mel um, is a company that I pretty much put together because throughout the years I've always been into art even since I was like yay five years old my parents always got got me into art and also like different type of programs where I can kind of branch out and kind of expand some of my knowledge with that skills with that so I decided to make it into my own business um Throughout the years, I do a lot of commission work. A lot of the pieces there on my table are just ideas that I had. I look at a lot of reference um, pictures for inspiration as well. Um, I had two pieces sold, which is my prized possessions, um, but I let them go. Um, the royalty series that sold um, at the Artworks Gallery uh, earlier this year. Um, I specialize in graphite and charcoal. Um, that's my primary um, tools that I like, but I do a lot of color pencil and um, I kind of branched into pastel as well. I would probably say my favorite is graphite and charcoal. It gets messy with the, with the charcoal, but that would so be my graphite. So graphite, okay, the easiest way I can explain it, you know how you're back in school, you got the number two pencil? That's graphite. Oh, uh, you okay. know, you, you, you write something, you try to erase it, that's graphite. But of course, the number two, I'm not, I can't get too detailed into it, but as an artist, they have different variations of graphite. You got some that's light, all the way up to dark. Like number two pencil, okay, that's kind of on the light scale. But when it starts to go into eight nines and tens, that means the, the blacker it gets. So, um, so that's the best way I can describe graphite. I just tell people like a number two pencil with different shades. So, yeah, yeah. Let's see, you take pride in this too. Oh yeah, I'm very um, particular. Um, I tell a lot of people. Perfectionist, like I said, I specialize in realism and a lot of detail. So if you have a blemish or gray hair or anything like that, I'm gonna try to capture that. Um, um, I've had different techniques where I can actually merge two separate pictures together. I have a lot of people that call me for commission and say, hey, you know, I've been in the past, but 
I want them to put this picture, or can you put them two together? I haven't done that as well. Um, so, um, like so I said, you for real, for real. Yeah, and it's not, I've done items. That's why I said um, anything realism. I sold a cherry piece. This is a practice piece I had. The cherries with water drops on it. And so, so, so we're gonna there. pause right here and we're gonna walk to her table, okay? Because she wants to show her, her shit. Okay. <laughs> Come on, boo. Go ahead, boo. All right, everybody. Extra bonus. I'm going to be doing an abundance of online course. Um, that was done with. Um, Prism of color uh, pencils and <laughs> right here the crown is actually gold. Like I said, I work in different mediums. So I do different sizes. I got up to 18 by 24, down to 5 by 7. So I do various sizes as well. is actually a print that piece is actually hanging into um it's actually hanging into aces uh sports lounge management purchased one of my pieces as well that's hanging up right in this bar lounge thank you i would tell her if you ever went to aces aces owner actually bought that piece for me that's a print but they um but she actually bought a um, copy of that kobe which is hanging up in her Right here, Aces is a popular spot.